Carefully remove the retention bandage or tape used to secure the dressing. Gently lift the edge of the dressing. Use Prontosan solution to loosen the dressing if necessary. Discard the old dressing. For application, it's important to select an appropriately sized dressing. Dressings can be cut to size, or several dressings can be overlapped for large wounds. Irrigate the wound using Prontosan. Dry the edges of the wound to prevent the adhesion of the dressing, and if necessary, apply an emollient to keep the skin hydrated. Apply the dark grey side of the dressing to the wound. Unlike other silver dressings, it's not necessary to wet the dressing at this stage. Secure the dressing using a secondary dressing or retention bandage to keep it in place. The frequency of dressing change will depend on the quantity of exudate. During the wear time, there will be a steady release of silver ions to control the bio burden in the wound. The paste is easy to apply and doesn't require any specialist skills. First, irrigate the wound with Prontosan and dry the surrounding skin. If necessary, debride the wound prior to application of the paste. Remove the tube from its packaging. Shake the tube and remove cap. Apply a thick layer to the wound ensuring that the entire wound bed is covered, leaving no dead spaces where bacteria could grow. A suitable secondary dressing is then applied over the paste and left in place for a maximum of three days, when it can be simply rinsed from the wound using a cleansing solution to remove any residue. It's important to reassess the wound at each dressing change and evaluate the appropriateness of the current treatment plan.